FK Austria side. Two changes from the first leg at Tynecastle. Horman back after suspension, number two, while Hannes Pleva comes in at number 11. Hearts for their 28th European tie make two changes from the first leg. Jim Sandinson is in in midfield, while captain Gary McCoy is on from the start. But there's no place for top scorer Ian Ferguson, missing because of a flu virus. Crowd of around the 15,000 mark in the Prato Stadium here in Vienna as the Spanish referee, Senor Negreria, gets the game underway. An important game for Hearts. No score in the first leg in Edinburgh and the white-shirted Austrians flowing forward. Henry Smith, very quick off his line. Hearts have won the free kick. Mike Galloway picks up an knock in the opening minute. Black trying to get it through to Bannon. Great effort, and Hearts come very close indeed. Wayne Foster, but it was Gary Mackay who set up the chance. A clear-cut opportunity for Hearts inside the first minute and a half. Sanderson, good ball to Bannon. The offside flag against the eager Mike Galloway. The referee letting it run. Herbert Prohaska. Hearts are obviously going to put Sanderson, push him on to the Austrian captain and try and check his uh, midfield thrust. He's the Austrian general in midfield. Good bit of play there by Foster, and Zach had to come back. Well, this would be a bad blow for Hearts if, uh, if Foster had to go down. Let's look at it in close-up. Well, the ball seemed to be cleared away, and Foster went down. Pfeffer moved across to the right side. Getting the better of Black and then being fouled. So the free kick to be taken, an anxious Henry Smith. As uh, out of your picture, Wayne Foster gets a little bit of treatment on the touchline. Floated in, Persidani coming in there. On to Prohaska's effort, and there it is! Offside though. Kudast. Chopped off. The outcome will be a free kick to Hearts, and Hearts in fact want to make a substitution. Catching the referee's attention. And look at this disallowed goal. You'll see the reason why. Coming in, yes. Clearly offside. Although it was put away well. And Hearts, as we watch this replay again, through the legs of Kidd. But it didn't count. Now, Hearts have made the substitution. Wayne Foster, who took that knock, has been replaced by John Cahoon. And that's Cahoon getting his first touch. Good ball to Kenny Black. Oh, a swinging cross that's pulled behind. No trouble at all for Franz Wolfhardt, who had such a good game for the Austrians in Edinburgh. The Hart supporters who have made the journey in full song. Sanderson's been quick in the midfield. And there's the substitute, John Cahoon.
tactical, weary game. Breaking to Sanderson. It looks lively and inventive for Hearts. And you can see clearly offside, but Galloway sticks it away just uh, in case. So there we are. Both teams have goals cancelled out, but uh, substitute John Cahoon making an impact already. The Austrians building from the back through Obermeyer. De Giorgi on the far side. Three at the back. Four in midfield and three up front. Kunas, the big West German. Persudani, the Argentinian. Thinking about a shot. Oh, great effort there by Persudani. And that's a corner to Hearts. The first of the game. Number six, Pfeffer, the man who conceded it. Bullfart pointing anxiously. As Bannon slings it in, the keeper stays put. Galloway's header picked up by the keeper at the rear post, but uh, Cahoon stepping for the half chance. Pfeffer. Hart's giving him room. Does little with it. Cahoon, the target man, battling and winning it well. Good support by Black. Very controlled performance by Hearts at this stage. Kai being caught in possession, though. So the Austrians guilty of giving the ball away too. Kid getting that one back to Henry Smith. Keep him warm on a cold night like this in Vienna. Galloway the target man. De Giorgi pressing him. Cahoon. by Berry, out to Kidd. Cahoon close to that touchline. Persidani. Neat little pass to Kunast. Ogres. Pleva. And that's Henry Smith. Again, a move that was set up by Persidani. And Ogres really should have done better. Galloway again winning it for Cahoon. Black. Kai. Fairly deep roll for him. Black shields it. Kai obstructed and the Spanish referee picking up the free kick. Good decision by Jose Maria Negrira. One booking so far in the match. Michael Kunast after 16 minutes for retaliation. Bannon to take it. Galloway could be the target man on the far side of the box. Eventually leaving it for Whitaker. The defence running out. And the linesman did put his flag up. But the referee blew his whistle anyway. Persudani. Person following him. 
Zach Ogres holding off Whitaker. Doesn't get a corner. Will settle for the throw. No, in fact, the free kick says the referee. Almost as good as a corner. The big men up there. Prohaska wanting Sanderson back the required distance. Smith stays. And a good bit of covering there by Brian Whitaker to concede a corner. Prohaska, the captain, going over to the left side to take the first corner. And look how dangerous this free kick was. Kerstudani missed it. Ogres didn't. And Whitaker took no chances. Neil Berry. Only as far as Obermeyer. And again, it's little Kerstudani. Neil Berry. Kid going forward now. Cahoon. Away past Obermeyer. Pfeffer just getting it away from Bannon. Now Mackay. And that shot taken a little bit too hurriedly. But again, it's Hart's turn to exert pressure on the Austrian defence. Obermeyer. 51 caps for Austria. And there's a mistake that lets Sanderson break. Four on a line. And that was a good interception and a timely one by Di Giorgi. Berry the man giving away the free kick. Prohaska wants to take it quickly. Jack. Ogres. Again, hearts of men in the right spot at the right time. Still no. Wayne Foster had a good shot, just went wide. And although they lost uh, Foster after 16 minutes or so, they brought on Cahoon and the balance was not disrupted. Although they had the ball in the net, so did the Austrians. And at half time, nothing each is an excellent result in this marvellous Prater Stadium in Vienna. So the second half is underway and Hearts would be hoping for a quick goal which would certainly put pressure on the Austrians. Throw in goes the Austrians way and Hormann gets it to Persidani. And Berry will get the yellow card for that. No question about it. The little Argentinian chopped down. Henry Smith was alert. The Harch bench and Wayne Foster who was uh, taken off after that ankle injury. Ali McDonald has been on his feet constantly during this match. And this time it's Hart's turn to get a free kick. As it's almost tit-for-tat stuff now. Horman is the man who gets a talking to. Cahoon back on his feet. Hearts of the chance for the free kick. Dave McPherson's up at the far side of the box. Galloway on a decoy run. Bannon and Cahoon. Galloway going down and that one didn't work out. And McPherson was calling for a long ball to be thrown into the penalty area there. 
and the move just petered out tamely. Hearts can't afford to pass up opportunities from the set piece. Bannon and Sanderson, Hearts attack. We need to watch the Austrian defence watching for the offside as Bannon holds it up. Angles it across, and they're onside. Kid, here it is for Hearts. Mike Galloway goes to the Hearts supporters. The trap has been broken. Mike Galloway, what a goal. And look at this. No flag, no whistle. Walter Kidd and Galloway immediately went to the near post. Kidded all the time. They tried to close him down, but look at this. Superb. Again, we see Walter Kidd. This is literally an inch perfect cross and a great goal for Hearts. Brilliantly intercepted by Whitaker. Whitaker turns on the style. Cahoon, back to Whitaker. Black, Bannon. Kept in by Whitaker. And it's Hart stringing the passes together and coming away with style. Cahoon down injured as Hearts flow through the middle. Sanderson, Pfeffer, and a great save by Wolfhart to deny Jimmy Sanderson, the youngster coming back into the Hearts first team and making such an impact. And what better stage? Look at this. And the keeper had to touch that one round the post. And the Hearts supporters just waiting to celebrate. Five seconds left. Hearts have the throw in. The 45 minutes are up. We're now into stoppage time. And Hearts controlling this right down to the final seconds. Galloway flicking that one loosely. All eyes on the Spanish referee. Kids. The Austrians battling for pride, and that looked a bit of a loose throw in. And you can see the clock there showing a full minute being played. It's Kunast to Prohaska. This Austrian side full of internationals. But it's Hearts who have run the show. De Giorgi, but here's Bannon. Cahoon breaking. Hearts on the break. Cahoon staying onside. But there is the final. No, it's a push. We thought it was the final whistle. Hearts supporters just desperate to celebrate full minute and a half played the referee has another look at his watch as again hearts closed down and the whistle has gone the heart supporters have made the journey to vienna proud of their side the way they played it was a controlled performance by Hearts, Mike Gallagher.